On Instagram, I came across a shocking clip of this hairbrush that seemed to magically smooth away frizz, flyaways, static hair, and it was something I really wanted to try out. Static is just really my number one enemy. So if there is this small, portable, battery-powered brush that I can just pop in my bag and keep on me to really keep my static at bay, I mean, that would be a game changer. Throughout my entire life, I've always had a problem with frizz. Anytime there's like 10% humidity, frizz. Anytime it's hot and then I start to get sweaty, frizz. Anytime I turn on the sink to brush my teeth, frizz. It's just frizz all the time and it's pretty hard to maintain even if I do everything that I can. The number one rule of curly hair is never brush your curly hair because it gets frizzy. So if this does work, then maybe I can break that rule. So it says on the box that it has ionic care to smooth. <laughs> to be honest, I have no idea what that means. I don't know too much about science or ions. Can someone tell me what an ion is? An ion is a positively or negatively charged atom. Positive ions open up your hair's cuticles, which can be great for volume but can also lead to frizz and flyaways. The theory behind this brush is to add negative ions back into the hair in order to seal the cuticles, resulting in smoother, shinier strands. Right, so let's open this up. Okay, so it's kind of just like the brush head. There's no like handle here. Oh, she's small. There is an on and off button. So let's just turn this on. I don't know if it like needs time to like charge the ions and stuff. You can hear a little bit of buzzing, so it's um hopefully this doesn't turn into a disaster. I'm honestly afraid to be holding it. For safety reasons, I'm going to do my homework. So it says brush hair softly from root to tip, pressing down for 10 to 15 seconds. <laughs> it does sound very inconvenient because I think I take probably 10 seconds to brush my entire head. At the very, very back of this booklet in tiny, tiny letters, it does say that the brush performs better when hair is slightly wet. But it also says immediately after, do not use after washing hair and allow hair to dry sufficiently. So, I'm not gonna get my hair wet at all because I'm frightened. I'm gonna brush my hair with this brush on this side first to give it a fair shot uh, at comparing with this brush. And we'll see if either does well or if neither does well or if I should just throw every brush I own away. This is why you don't brush curly hair. <laughs> don't do it. So if you look, um, there is quite a bit of frizz still, especially at the top. I am just gonna completely mess up my hair and get it all nice and staticky. <laughs> This isn't helping at all. This isn't really solving my problem one bit. Seeing as this did nothing <laughs> to fix my hair and it still is a mind of its own, I'm gonna go in with this guy. So I'm gonna see if it does what I saw it do on Instagram, where it just like magically attracted the hair. For some reason, that makes me think it's working. If I see it causing some movement, I'm gonna feel like the ions are true, the ions are real. real. 
Oh. Okay. I see it like kind like just ever so slightly. It is not as dramatic as what you see online. Surprisingly, the internet is not always true. I don't care what this thing says. This is just a regular brush. And a regular brush is destructive. It's like a little smoother. No, it's not. I lied. I'm a big liar. I was I was hopeful for one second. This has more of a shine to it. Um, and I guess you could say that it is smoother. There's, there's still some uh, frizz, like a tiny little bit compared to this side. This side is a lot smoother. This side has more volume while this one is just more frizzy. Okay, okay. Surprisingly, that did help. It's not sticking to my face anymore. My hair is very, very soft and very smooth on this side, and I see like no flyaways or static electricity. And on this side, like it's kind of calming down a bit because some time has gone by, but I can still see the static like all right here. Still, it's like kind of clinging to my face, and I definitely see and feel a difference. I'm going back to rule one, and I'm never doing this again. Don't do this. <laughs> Buy a regular brush, if anything. <laughs> and don't do that, even. I would say that it is very useful, especially compared to all of the other methods I've tried to use, all of the products that I've tried to put in my hair to prevent frizz. This has been like, not a perfect solution, but a better solution for what it is. It's very compact, so I can just slip this in my bag and break it out when I need to. Most simply, yes or no, does this Ionic hairbrush work to tame static? Yeah, it does. I mean, I definitely saw a difference using this brush, especially compared to a regular hairbrush. I do think that this Ionic hairbrush does make my hair a lot smoother and tame my flyaways better than my usual go-to method of hairspray or a dryer sheet. Um, however, I don't think the effects last for any longer than those other methods do. I do think I would like it a lot more if it not only got rid of my static, but also helped keep it at bay like throughout the entire day. I feel like, what's the dog that's not a poodle, but has the ears, what's that dog called? Cocker Spaniel. I feel like a Cocker Spaniel. Yeah.